Hello, my name is Nicholas Edwin, Application Specialist with Imagina Technologies. Our tech tip today will discuss different data silos where users can download and obtain large data sets for Autodesk InfoWorks. So InfoWorks is being used for more and more conceptual projects within engineering firms. Some of the questions we get is where do I retrieve data to assemble my project? Usually, the engineer has a surveyed surface for his or her project, but would like to get more of a surrounding areas to make the model appear more realistic. So here's what I recommend. InfoWorks can import large amounts of data formats. So one of my first suggestions is to look carefully at all the available formats that can be used. By clicking on the Home ribbon tab and navigating to the Import panel, selecting the different feature types and carefully looking at the extensions will help. The reason for looking at the extensions is that you may already have some of this data on your company's existing LAN network. And this will save you time and disk space on your servers so that you don't duplicate or download the same files. A more pronounced list of these file types can be accessed through the InfoWorks training guide, which we'll discuss next. So what if you are starting from scratch and don't have a starting point? Well, another option is the InfoWorks tutorial. It can be accessed by clicking on the Help ribbon tab. Navigating to the Learn InfoWorks, click on the Tutorial commands. And within this tab, we get to access the Tutorial and InfoWorks Training Guide. In the browser, if we click on the Interactive Tutorials, we can find different formats that's available to the user. Inside the Interactive Tutorials, Finding Data on the Web, users can click on, for example, Finding Building Data. This process shows exactly what can be entered into Google to access data in your part of the country. It shows you exactly how the wording needs to be typed in in Google search parameters in your local county to retrieve building data. Here's an example. Typing in my GIS plus data plus downloads plus billings and my county name. It gives me a list of available information that I can download. By clicking on the links and accepting it, I was fortunate to have this data in my county and available to me. Again, results may vary depending on where you are. Another interactive guide is finding terrain data. The interactive guide shows you a link where data can be accessed from many parts of the U.S. In this case, the USGS viewer. This viewer gives me an overall view of the entire United States where users can simply zoom in and find their local area. Now that I'm zoomed in to my local area, I can create a bounding box Select the data fields that I'm interested in. And pick the available file types that correlate with InfoWorks. Now that my file types have been selected, a shopping cart list will be available to me. And now I can check out the shopping cart by simply typing in my email address and placing an in order. In a few minutes, I'll receive an email where I can click on the links and download these files to be used in my InfoWorks projects. Last step is to unzip these files, place them on my network, and now I can connect to this information using InfoWorks. So thanks for spending the time with me learning that where base data can be harvested for use in Autodesk InfoWorks.